After what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Kemsky was just playing with me. He didn't know anything. Why did Kemsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? It's an old story, Connor. It doesn't pertain to your investigation. I'm not a unique model, am I? How many Connors are there? I don't see how that question pertains to your investigation. I saw a photo of Amanda at Kamsky's place. She was his teacher. I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. You're the only one who can prevent civil war. Find the Deviants, or there will be chaos. This is your last chance, Connor. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to Cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank. But it's over. We can't just give up like that. I know we could have solved this case. So you're going back to cyber life? I have no choice. I'll be deactivated and analyzed to find out why I failed. What if we're on the wrong side, Connor? What if we're fighting against people who just want to be free? I know we're on the right side. Humans created us. They're our masters. No machine should rebel against its creator. When you refused to kill that android at Kamsky's place, you put yourself in her shoes. You showed empathy, Connor. Empathy's a human emotion. You're wrong, Lieutenant. My actions were determined by statistical data. I'm not a deviant. I'm sorry to disappoint you. I know it hasn't always been easy, but I want you to know I really appreciated working with you. And that's not just my social relations program talking. I, I really mean that. At least, I think I do. Well, well, here comes Perkins, that motherfucker. Sure don't waste any time at the FBI. We can't give up. I know the answers and the evidence we collected. If Perkins takes it, it's all over. There's no choice. You heard Fowler. We're off the case. You've got to help me, Lieutenant. I need more time so I can find a lead in the evidence we collected. I know the solution is in there. Listen, Connor. If I don't solve this case, Cyberlife will destroy me. Five minutes. That's all I ask.
key to the basement is on my desk. Get a move on. I can't distract him forever. Perkins, you fucking cocksucker. <gasps> Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I'm registering the evidence in my possession. But don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. Son of a bitch! Jericho is somewhere in the Ferndale neighborhood. Now I can scan their memories and narrow the search. The Deviant took a child hostage.
lied to me, Connor. I trusted you and you lied to me. You were going to kill that child. You gave me no choice. I need to find Jericho. Do you know where it is? You're wasting your time. I don't know anything about Jericho. But I hope that one day, you pay for what you did to me. I need to find Jericho. Tell me how to get there. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Now leave me alone! this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the Deviants. You're off the case. And now, it's gonna be definitive. people now. 